All right, y'all. Uh, Shalom. We give them all praises unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rakaku Dash. Double honors unto the apostles and our elders. You don't, you can't be disrespecting the elders. You got to honor your elders. And we're gonna say, uh, you know, what I'm saying, double honor to the elders and uh, Shalom to the hopeful elect. I can. Let's get into that about the elders. So who was that guy that was talking shit about the elders? Bert and Ernie, they called him. Yeah. Uh, oh, Bert and Ernie. I, I forgot their names. Huh? I, I don't. I don't even never knew that guy, but he. I think he's been teaching about over about ten years or something. I've been seeing him around ever since I was young in the faith. You know, and that makes me angry when I say, "Well, it don't make me angry." But it's like, Pfft. I mean, you get mad, but you're like, "There go another one, another one." Well, he lasts about ten or so years. That tells you, bro, you know, just how long you've been doing this don't mean nothing. People, you know, you got to uh, skip that scripture. Keep my works until the end. And part of those keeping works is honoring your elders. So apparently this guy, he thinks he's still in the truth, but he's not because he done fucked up. Apparently, <laughs> he has a problem with, because, uh, you know, the elders teach that uh, my child is King David, right? So he had a problem with that. You know, he's like, how could he be King David? Well, all I got to say is this. Out of all the things the elders taught you, these thousands and millions of breakdowns, out of all these things, you're going to get mad at him just because one thing you disagree with him with. You know? That's disrespectful. You know, if you really disagree with him, you should have just kept your damn mouth shut. How about that? A lot of these guys don't know how to operate, man. You see, the thing is, what I've noticed in that whole account is you're not looking at it at a, on a prophetic standpoint as far as, you know what I'm saying, John the Baptist coming back, Elijah coming back. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's where, that's where I got it from. It's like, it made complete sense how... It does sound strange Abba, at yeah. first, but... Well, how Abba Bibbins coming back. That's a you know spiritual thing, saying, man. Yeah. That's a spiritual thing, man. Yeah, so we... Sending Elijah, you know what I'm saying, to come... Because we all spiritual. We all know all of us is somebody back in the reincarnation, you know? But y'all gonna get mad if I say this brother is a... Uh, he Andrew, so y'all mess like nah. <laughs> what if he was Andrew? We're gonna find out. It's like nah. You know, but you know, who, but that's a spiritual thing. Maybe the spirit be showing you stuff, man. It's not stuff you can explain. You know? How, it, but anyway, that's not even the point. The point is you should have kept your mouth shut, and that's where you fucked up. What's it called? Tact. You gotta have tact, you gotta have omerita, you gotta have. Like when you in the mafia, you won't go talking shit about you had a disagreement with the head. You can just make a video about him. And like, oh, he going off. Right. No, bro, you're going to be swimming with the fishes. You know, they're going to give you some concrete shoes and throw your ass off the bridge. You know what I mean? That's out of order. Isn't that out of order? Come on now, man. If you really want to do the work of the Lord, man, do it the right way. Don't be out there just being all rebellious and stuff, man. You know? Let's focus on the, the you know, whatever. Do the dummy. Go ahead. What you got something? Uh, <laughs> oh, you got, oh, this is uh, Revelation two or twenty six. He that overcometh and keep my works unto the end, to him will I give power over the nation. That's the one you want to. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. So you gotta keep the well. Yeah, keep the works. Wait, that guy probably thinks he's still doing the work, right. but he's not doing the work because now he's just talking shit about the elders. Look. If, now he's going to be one of, you know, a lot of guys, they fall out the truth. Or they fall out of GMS. They think they're still in the truth. But then their whole career turns into uh, talking shit about the elders. And then that's all their main focus is from here on out. We've seen it a hundred times. Time and time again happens. I got something real quick. Um, this is just an account when the outside was talking to Peter. You know, he was just asking, like, who am I? The outside was asking, who do you think I am? Uh, this is Matthew 16, and uh, we we'll start at 15. He said unto them, For whom say ye that I am? And Simon Peter answered and said, Thou art the anointed, the son of the living power. And Yahweh answered and said unto him, Blessed art thou, Simon Barjona, for flesh and blood have not revealed it unto thee, but my Father which is in heaven. So, you know, the things that were, that's revealed unto us is spiritual things. Coming from your high body, shimmy, high side, not necessarily fleshly things. See, Jake looking at things on the, on a flesh, carnal aspect, and we looking at things as a as a spiritual aspect. You know. If somebody feels something in the spirit like that, maybe this guy is this guy. I mean, I, well, maybe, yeah. maybe. You know. Yeah. I be thinking all kind of stuff. I don't even tell y'all about. Yeah. So. You know what I mean? Yeah. So like, um, 
for instance, for the apostles' sake, you know, through the Spirit, they feel like, you know what I'm saying? Or, hey, we do as well. We agree with them um, 100% as well through the Spirit. Uh, now, Masha, uh, King David. Yeah, King David. But uh, what we learned from him. Mm -hmm. We're teaching what he taught. If he wasn't, we wouldn't be here if it wasn't for him. So that dude's out of order, man. Come on now. We believe that Abba Bivens is who they are. Abba Bivens is who he is. You know what I'm saying? It, on down. And like he said, he said, uh, he said, uh, Masha never even talked about it like that. You know, right, it, yeah. it was just a spiritual thing, you know, amongst them. Yeah, he told us that because I don't know. The, we didn't personally know him, you know, back then, you know. So, but if it wasn't for these guys, man, we wouldn't be doing what we're doing, man. So, y'all got to stay in your lane out there. Just keep your mouth shut, man. You got no place to be in there correcting elders and stuff, man. That's disrespectful and it's not a good look, you know. And especially if, if you're wrong. Quick, this is um, John six. And, this is this is just an example. John six and sixty. Uh, many therefore of his disciples, when they have heard this, said, "This is a hard saying." It's a hard saying. Oh, that's why a lot of guys leave GMS. Why? Because they, they get these hard sayings, you know. And, and, and the elders even tell you, like, they're like, "Look, if you receive it, he always says it. If you'll receive it, he's telling you this ain't for everybody to receive this thing." Okay, go ahead, read that again. This is when Yahusha knew himself. Oh, it's like I skipped it. Many, therefore, of his disciples, when they had heard this, said, This is a hard saying. Who can hear it? When Yahusha knew in himself that his disciples murmured at it, he said unto them, Does this offend you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What, and if ye shall see the Son of Man ascend up where he was before, it is the Spirit that quickeneth the flesh, profiteth nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are life. They're, it's like they are spirit and they are life. But. There are some of you that believe not. For you have a shot new from the beginning who they were that believe not and who should betray them. Yeah. Keep going. Um, and he said unto, it's like, and he said, therefore I say unto you that no man can come unto me except they were given up unto him of my father. Keep going. He says, from that time many of the disciples went back and walked no more with him. So we have a lot of brothers left us over minor disagreements. You know, but little leaven leavened the whole lump. So get your ass up out of there. Uh, we won't go this way, that let's go this way. We didn't win this way in a minute, right? I don't know. Uh, yeah, keep going. This is one of my favorite scriptures in the entire Bible. Uh, it says, uh, um, it says, from that time, many of his disciples went back and walked no more with him. Then said, y'all shine to the twelve, where you go also. So he's what? asking the twelve, y'all gonna leave too? And hey, that's how utter to Harvey in the videos. Well, y'all gonna leave too? Get to stepping. Pack your bags. Get out. <laughs> I love that spirit, man. That's why we love the Apostle Tahar. Go ahead. This is the end. Simon Peter answered him, Lord, to whom shall we go that have the words of eternal life? Yeah, he said, where are we going to go? We ain't leaving you. You got the words of eternal life. Why are we going to leave you? And that's why we telling you, brothers. So if y'all want to leave, go ahead and get it. Go on. Well, we staying right where we at, bro. These, we got these words of eternal life. You know? And we like, you know? And I'm going to stay with Great Millstone. The elder Tahar still got, I still got a lot to learn from him, you know, and the other apostles, right? I'm really, I'm still young. You still young. You still young. I mean, you know, I've been doing this thing for a minute, but really I'm still, how long have I been teaching? I don't know. Not long enough. Go ahead. Uh, you know, I think the apostles, have been, the apostles, see, in my case, been doing this longer than I've been alive. You know, so a lot of brothers. Exactly. Doing this thing longer than we've been alive. Apostle Tahar was out there doing the work when I was like in, in, in elementary school. You weren't even born yet. Right. You know? Like I said, we still got a lot to learn from this guy. So I, you know, I get excited. I see the elders' videos pop up. I get excited. You know, I'm not going to go sit and talk shit. No, I'm excited, man, because I'm about to learn something. You know? Go ahead. The elder Tahar be going, you know, who else? He's probably, probably, he's the top teacher. And the Bible on the planet Earth. Bunch of dummies. Go ahead. It says we believe. A lot of people can't receive that. What's that? Oh, uh, I mean, no, that's the way I look at it. Because yeah, who else goes like him? I mean, when we see get him get El Tahar in a debate, but well, he don't want to do that. Because it's not about debating. But he could debate any of these guys, man. Anybody. And he ain't got to, you know.
are sure that thou art the Messiah, the Son of the living God. Thou shalt answer them, Have not I have chosen you twelve, and one of you is a devil. He spoke with Judas Iscariot. So we always going to have the devil. We're going to have the betrayers, the Judases. Yeah. What's your boy, Bert and Ernie? Which one? Oh, they over there. They've been watching Andrew Tate. <laughs> right. Everybody boxing and doing push ups now. <laughs> I'm about to do my push ups, bro. <laughs> They ain't got the woman training over there. I'll go read. What you got, Rita? It says, for ye, it is that should betray him, being one of the twelve. So, yeah, so we, we have, uh, you know, people betrayed the Lord back in the day. Here it is, the Lord is doing miracles and stuff. You know, he was uh, feeding the multitudes of people with miracles, you know, he, with the loaves of bread and the crumbs. I mean, he did all these miracles. They seen him do the miracles, but he said one little thing that offended him, and they left. What the fuck is wrong? With me? That's two thirds, though, bro. If if you match that description, you're part of the two thirds, my friend. You got to be. You cannot be part of the elect acting like that. I'm sorry. We don't have that spirit of uh, being disrespectful towards our elders over here. Okay. I cannot stress that enough, man, because it's just like my father and my mother in real life. I would never think twice to talk back to them, even if I knew that she was wrong, and most of the time she was wrong. You know, you just got to suck it up. Yeah. Yeah. You know? I'm not saying that odors are wrong. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying. Right, right. Just an example, you know? Yeah, yeah I seen that. That's, uh, they make, they're doing that remake of Bel Air, whatever the fuck, French Prince. Whatever. I heard it's trash. Yeah, yeah, I just watched a little part of it. And I seen the dude, he was cussing out his father. He was, because cause he started disrespecting his mother. Really, he was telling the truth. He's like, your mother was getting on my ass. She was being a demon, pretty much. And he, he started getting mad. You know, don't you dare talk to my mama like that. You motherfucker, bitch ass nigga. And all this other, like, damn, like, that shit crazy. You should, and, and the scripture says what? That, and it's in Deuteronomy, that you should fear your parents. And you know what I'm saying? Our spiritual parents is the, uh, is the elders. You, you, you be fucking crazy to talk to your parents like that. Especially back in the day, your ass would get slapped up. You know exactly. So what do you think for the week? I mean, the elders, the elders ain't going to come over here and jump over here and slap your ass up. Maybe with. they should. It's like, nah. <laughs> hey, hey, Nehemiah did. Right, right, you know right. Remember that scripture when Nehemiah was beating their asses? Right. Watch out for this hey, how should I beat them with a whip? Right. So I would not be against it. <laughs> See, Elder Tahar come out. Shut down. Right. Get back in formation. Catch right. <laughs> that like, uh, that, that was it though, man. John. Yeah, oh, I don't want to walk through that little family thing. Let's just go this way. I wanted to hit the bridge, but they already got it occupied. That's all right. Where are you at? I can't. I can barely see the camera. Uh, I really just want to grab this Hebrews 11 in the second verse. I'm going to just read up. It says, Now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. <laughs> Why do we believe in your house shot? You know, uh, read that again. It says, now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Let me ask y'all, how many of y'all out there believe in Yahweh Shai? For you, anybody watching, that's the one they call Jesus. How many of y'all believe in the Lord, the Son of the Most High, but you ain't never seen him? But you still believe in him though, right? That's how a lot of things that we believe in is, you know, we haven't seen it. Well, some brothers seen the Lord. I'll have to say that. But at one time we believed before we seen him, you know what I mean? So half the stuff we believe in we ain't seen, you know? Mm -hmm. People always oh, don't want to believe in, but they can't be, you gotta be spiritual, man. So brothers believe in something spiritual, you ain't supposed to be hating on that. That's the spirit working, bro. You hating on the spirit. Don't hate on the spirit. You can't fight against the spirit. You gotta flow with the spirit. They going against the spirit. Like I said, bro, if it wasn't for uh, if it wasn't for my Shaw and all the other elders and apostles, we wouldn't even be here, bro. Yo ass is to be out there rapping or something with a mixtape. You know? It says, for by it the elders obtained a good report. Yes, all the elders obtained a good report, you know? From your house, Shaw. Man, that's just a thing, man. People, oh, man, it's just, it's just part of the business, man. 
You know, guys come in and the guys fall out. Like, I've made a post on Telegram. I said, I've, the whole time I've been doing this since what? Well, since I've been on YouTube since early, what, 2009 or whatever, I've seen more guys. I've seen a lot of guys come into the faith, but I've seen more guys fall out than I have stay in. Especially this camp. I, this camp used to be pretty big. Where are they at now? That was just us. I'm glad, too. Go ahead. Will you have something? First Timothy five and one rebuke not an elder, but treat him as a father. And yeah, treat uh, what it, like you just said. Uh, treat him. Read that again. It says rebuke not an elder, but treat him as a father, and the younger men as brethren. Yeah. So you supposed to you supposed to treat the elder as a father. And like what scripture says, honor thy mother and thy father. And I sit there and talk shit, and make videos about him. If you have a disagreement with the elder, you don't make a video about him. I, are you dumb or what? Was well, you want raised right, boy? <laughs> Like, who does shit like that? That's just off, period. I mean, if you had disagreements, what? Hey, get this scripture if you got it. Uh, get it, you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. I say get it, you know what I mean. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. You got to tell them first in private and all that? Yeah. Okay. It's uh, 1 Peter 5 and 1. It says, the elders which are among you shall not know. So like it, 1 Peter 5 and 5. It says, likewise, ye younger, submit yourselves unto the elder. Yeah, all of you be subject one to another. Right, who's that one guy? Bert and Ernie, dude. He, this some bitch ain't been in the truth, but what? 10 years, maybe? 11, 12, whatever? Bruh, Elder Tahor, I seen a video he got from 1985 or something. Or way back when. I don't know how, that was an old video. He's, you know? And he was talking about the Mark of the Beast back in the 80s. Where was you at in the 80s, bro? Playing with crayons in a coloring book. Can I read that again? This is First Peter 5 and 5 says, Likewise, ye younger, submit yourself unto the elder. Yeah, all of you be subject one to another. Be subject to one another, not just, you know, subject unto yourself. Go ahead. It says, and be clothed with humility. Humility? That's not being humility. Making a video for the whole world to see? What, are you trying to embarrass people or something? That's what he think. That's what they think. Oh, I'm, I'm going to put him to shame with this video. I'm going to be right. I'm going to look good, and they're going to look bad. You see, just think. Look at vocab. Now, he, he, when you spend me, vocab could use that against, the, against us. You know what I'm saying? Or try to, which, you know, at the exactly. end of the day, we don't give a yeah, fuck. Yeah, we don't care. It's like still, now you got people who, who've been shunning the apostles to hard. And yeah, the you get. Going down. You're giving them free will. To, oh, look, look at they, look how they, they can't think about them and shit like that. Don't know how to fucking move right, man. You know what it is, though. You know what it is. It has nothing to do. Him falling, breaking away from GMS has nothing to do with who he believed in who King Monsal is. He was looking for a way out. That, that's what it is. Guys are always looking for a way out because their heart's not really in it. And so they're going to use whatever issue they can find. Like, oh, I'm going I'm, I'm to use this. And now, you know, I'm going to get up out of this somehow. So they just looking for a way out of sin. That's really what it is, man. They looking for a way out. Well, psh, all you had to do was just leave. Bye. Right. I mean, we'll let you go. You know, we'll help kick you. You know, don't let the door hit you on the way. Well, how's that go? Don't let the door hit you on the ass on the way out. Or how would that go? This is for you. How resisteth the proud and giveth grace to the humble? That's not being humble. You're making videos about guys you learned from and stuff, you know? Regardless of what, you know, man, this is disrespectful, man. You disrespect your goddamn self when you did that. Big Bird and Ernie looking son of bitches. That's so funny. They're all rubber ducky. You're the one looking head ass. <laughs> Wasn't Bird and Ernie gay? <laughs> Bert and Ernie. They really did look like Bert and Ernie. I was dying, bro. Uh, I guess more. Yeah, that's it. Alright, this one from Matthew 18 and um, 15. Moreover, if thy brother shall trespass against thee, go and tell him his fault between thee and him alone. Yeah, go tell him it between him alone, man. And that's your brother. Now, that's talking about your brother, not an elder. That's all. You know, that's a whole nother thing. Matter of fact, if you got it, keep it to yourself. Go ahead. It says. If he shall hear thee, thou hast gained thy brother. But if he will not hear thee, then 
take with the one or two more. So I have no idea if this guy took it. Did he ask the elders at first? I'm sure he probably was talking shit before he made a video. I don't know. I have no idea. But go ahead. So I don't know. I don't know everything about behind the scenes and stuff, you know. But this is still a good scripture to follow. Because if you have a problem with the brother, you don't go you automatically make a video trying to embarrass somebody and stuff. You That means you're in this for the wrong reasons. Right, at the end of the day, you're still going to be teaching the exact same thing they taught you. Maybe, not, maybe not. I don't know. But it seemed like that's the only issue he got. The one, yeah, one, one thing. Else. Say he's looking for a way out. And that's a spiritual thing that you got to see through the spirit. You know? That's they're a, not, they're yeah. not pushing at his doctrine. Necessarily. Yeah, they don't be pushing that heavy, you know. That's a spiritual thing. They always said, if you can receive it, man. And we was not teaching. Like I said, oh. it makes sense because they always bring scriptures to, to back up exactly what they think and how they feel through the spirit. You remember we was out teaching the other day. We brought it up. The dude was getting on us. He's like, y'all ain't who you learn this from. I said, you gotta listen to the elders. And so we learned this from Yahweh. We learned this from King David. <laughs> We brag about it, but go ahead. It says that in the mouth of two or three witnesses, every word may be established. If you will neglect to hear them, tell it to the church. And if you neglect to tell, hear the church, let him be unto thee as a heathen and a publican. Yeah, so that's how you're really supposed to settle a matter. Man, do that thing in private, man. If somebody's really going, is the elders really going off that bad that you need to get on a video? I mean, what all they teaching is so evil that you need to make a video about them and try to think you're going to embarrass someone. He's the one that's going to get embarrassed. You done fucked up, you know. But you know you done fucked up, right? What was that? What movie was that from? Oh, is that Menace of Society? He's like, you know you done fucked up, right? Yeah, Menace. <laughs> yeah, that's, that, that nigga caused the division. You know what I'm saying? Because, like, that could, that could be, like, that, imagine that shit. Like, imagine you go to fucking school or something, and you got your teachers, and then the math teacher coming to them, English teachers, Class, like, hey, nigga, I don't, got, I don't appreciate you doing this. In yeah. front of all the damn students. In front like, of everybody. Yeah, in front of the students. Yeah, man, like, you making the teacher. Now that now this, some of them guys, they might lose confidence in the teacher over that. Yeah. You know? Like, oh, hell no. Nah. Then people going to be choosing sides. Oh, I like this math teacher better. I like this teacher. But that's good, though, because the Lord, what he say? I came to bring division. So, yeah, this is your Howard Shai doing this. He's dividing the sheep from the goat. You know? Because you're deweeting from the tares. So we know tares are heathens, but it's actually twofold. Tares can be heathens, but they can also be spiritual heathens. You know, our people who want to act like heathens, they got damn tares too, and they're going to get burned up. Two-thirds of Israel, will they not get burned up in a fire? That's a tear. That's a tear. And that's a part of that system process is the doctrine, the teaching, the, the stumbling blocks. You know? Uh, give me a... Uh, Give me, uh, is it 2 Peter or 1 Peter 3 and 16? Something like that. One of the two. No, it'd be 1 Peter 3 and 16, I think. I'll go ahead, what you got? You got it, 1 Peter 3 and 16? Having a good conscience? Yeah. Uh, uh, 1 Peter 3 and 16, but uh, having a good conscience that whereas they speak evil of you, as of evildoers, it may be a shame that falsely accuse your good conversation in your house. Is that first? Yeah. Go ahead. For it, for it is better if the will of God be so that you suffer for well doing than for evil doing. For your house also have once suffered for sins, the just for the unjust, and it might bring us to God, being able to put to death in the flesh, but quickened by the Spirit, by which also he went and preached unto the spirits in prison. Uh, which sometimes we're disobedient when once the long suffering of God waited in the days of Noah. Are you supposed to long suffer too, though? You know, what's that suffer wrong for? Oh, isn't I got all kind of scriptures flying through my head? Let me see that real quick. Is that the one I wanted? Is that where it says some things? What's the one that says hard to be understood? Ain't it in here somewhere? Some things are hard to be understood. I thought I was in First Peter three. Maybe it was it something in sixteen? I ain't pulled it. In. I thought I had it memorized. Slacking, Akim. <laughs> Being old. Oh uh, yeah, but oh second. second. Oh, it was Second Peter. Yeah. Why I get confused? I'll go ahead and read that. Second Peter three and sixteen. It says, 
as also in all his epistles, speaking in them of these things, in which are some things hard to be understood. Right, I mean, even in Paul's, we know Paul's writings be hard for a Christian. But there's a lot of things in the Bible in general, man, that are hard to be understood, and it's not for novies. It is not for somebody of an unsound mind in an unstable spirit. You know what I mean? So some things are hard to be understood. So some things take time for you to see it. Some things took me time to see it. You know what I did? If I didn't, like, I can't even think of an example. It was probably, you know, I can't think of it right now. I'm sure there's something that I didn't quite get. But, you know, I just kept my mouth shut. And then years later, I was like, oh, shit, I get, I get that. Like me personally, I know something Australian offense, cause I didn't, I, I didn't understand the division, like why all the camps was different. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but That's obvious. Once I got into GMS and started getting deeper, I started understanding. What it you do see why there's division? Yeah. People ain't fucking right. Cause everybody want to be the superstar. Everybody want to be the leader. Everybody wants to be the know-it-all. Look, we're not in this to be the know-it-all and be better than everybody. Oh, I know more than you. And... That's not even what this thing's about, bro. You know? That's like Sakari. He went off and formed his own thing. Why? Because he thinks he knows every goddamn thing. Go ahead. He says, which they that are unlearned and unstable rest. He said, that dude was unstable. He could see he was unstable, you know? That's unstable. Go ahead. He says, as they do also the other scriptures unto their own destruction. He did that unto his own destruction, man. Now what happened to that guy? He's getting destroyed. Everybody's making videos about him. You see, that's what happened, bro. What did you think was? What do you think is going to happen when you come against the elders? You just pissed off the entirety of Great Millstone, and now you got 500 people making videos on your dumb ass, making you look dumb as hell. That's a battle you can't win. <laughs> that was the Most High that did that to you. <laughs> Who? That was the Most High did it. Most High is responsible for everything that happens. This is Romans 16, 17. It says, Now I beseech you, brethren, mark them which cause division. Oh, that guy's causing division, man. Well, okay, you had a disagreement. Big deal. Big fucking deal. Keep it to your goddamn self. Don't tell nobody about it, right? And pray. How about you do that? Pray. And is the scripture on it? Pray for understanding. You know, you got to pray for understanding, man. Because he, he's still wearing the garments, ain't he? Where'd you get that from? You still calling yourself an Israelite, right? Does he got a Hebrew name? You know, uh, some people say that's not the real pronunciation. You know, you got proof on that? That's the real pronunciation? You got proof? And stop using that Hebrew, boy. You know? What else? Yeah, how was I? A lot of people disagree. Oh, they, there's no proof for that. Well, you got, is that in the scriptures? The way to say Yahweh Shai's name properly? Is that in the Bible? You know? That's not in the scriptures. Go ahead. So we marking that fool. Go ahead. And offenses contrary to the doctrine which he have learned and avoid them. And the main offense he caused was rebuking elders, man. And he wasn't cussing us. He probably thought he was doing it respectfully. No, that isn't. That's not respectful, man. It was actually a sad sight to behold, indeed. We'll see how see how long that guy. How long? How think? How long do you think that guy will last? You know, they usually go for about what, three, six months? Right. And then they just fizzle out and fade away and go they go back to the world. He wanna to try to I'm still in the truth, watch, I'm still doing my videos. Let's just go back to the world, bro. You know you that's what you want, go do it. Uh I got a precept so uh, Sirach one and thirty, exalt not thyself, at least I fall. And bring dishonor upon our soul. <laughs> Where's that at? That's fire. Uh, Sirach 1 and 30. Well, read that again. That's a good one. It says, Exalt not thyself, lest thou fall, and bring dishonor upon our soul. So this guy was exalting himself. He might have not said it outright, but his his actions. He's trying to make it look like he knows more than the elders. Even if, let's pretend he's right. You don't do that. That's not how you behave, man. There's some scriptures say you can suffer wrongfully, but you, you know, you got to suck it up, man. That's why that's when being a man come in, you know? This dude's still a little boy. Go ahead. It says, And so God discovered thy secrets and cast thee down in the midst of the congregation. That, 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 he got cast down. 500 brothers making, probably more than that, making videos on his ass. It says, Because thou 
that thou camest not in the truth to the fear of the Lord, but thy heart is full of deceit. Uh, that's the fear, bro. I do not want, that's the fear of the Lord. Like when we watch the elders' videos, we don't want our, our name to come out the elders' mouth in a bad way. We don't want that to happen. That's the fear of the Lord, you know? Just like I don't want to upset my father in real life. You know, he's already passed away, but you know, you don't want to, you want to make your father proud. Not make him be ashamed to get into arguments and shit with him all the time. What kind of sense does that make? That don't even make no goddamn sense. That's a fucking, what, what's that? That's a, that, that'd be a, uh, what do you call that? Uh, what kind of family, uh, what's the bad families when they all fucked up? Dysfunctional? Yeah, that's a dysfunctional family right there. This ain't no dysfunctional family over here. This is a family where we believe in discipline, and you do something bad, you get your ass beat. How about that? And you ain't talking back to your parents. You get smacked in your lips. You know, spiritually speaking, we actually go smack them. Well, we might now. It's like, <laughs> I, I got one more. Uh, Surah 32 and 9, it says, If thou be among great men, it says, Make not thyself equal with them. Yeah, don't make yourself equal with them like you're the know-it-all. Matter of fact, when you're around the elders, keep your mouth shut. Right. Don't speak until spoken to for the most part. Yeah. And, until you know they let you know, you know. Yeah. Did you see that video I posted in the telegram about the brothers telling young guys how to talk to the elders? Damn, and I how to deal with it. Yeah, it's a really good video to watch. I posted it twice because you know we post so much stuff. I, I wanted to make sure people was watching that, man. Yeah. That was a good video, man. The spirit was on him when he made that video because he's seen the same shit all over the place, man. Guys think they can be friends with the elders and stuff. Like they're not here to be your friends. They're here to teach you and instruct you. I mean, it's like your father. You're, I mean, you can be friends with your... But he's your father. He's not your friend. He's your father. Know the difference. You know? Go ahead. It says... I'm going to start up a couple of verses first. Uh, Sirach 32 and 7. Speak, young man, if there be need of thee, and yet scarcely when thou art acts twice... That that speech be short, comprehended much in a few words. How long was that dude's video? Ooh. Yeah, boy, he made a video about the elders. That was, that was all kind of words he had up coming out. <laughs> you get beat, man? Yeah, yeah. That, see us? That's built into us, man. We know better. I even knew that when I was young. Well, growing up, my mom and dad put that in me. You know? Well, when I was around all the elders and stuff at the house, you know, aunts and uncles and all that came over for dinner. I ain't just sitting there running my mouth to everybody. I get smacked in the mouth. I've been smacked in my mouth plenty of times. You know, being disrespectful to my parents. They pow! See, that just reminds me. So I remember my sister, she was younger. She's younger now, but she was a lot younger at that time. That's when I was living with my mom and shit. And then she, my cousin, he lived with us at that time, too. And he, he was, he was like, like, correcting her. He was actually wrong in the situation because my mom said she can do it or whatever. But then she kind of mapped at him, and I got mad. Like, like you know, even though he's wrong, I mean, you still don't talk to him like that. He's a grown ass man. You yeah. don't talk to nobody like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, that. so I can, so I can, I can see the reason. I can see kind of a little bit how the elders feel. Like, even if they, even just, just saying, I'm not saying they're wrong, but even if they was wrong, yeah. you still don't talk to your elder like that, or your father, your mother. That's right, like man. That. These guys don't got it. They not built like us, man. That's what they don't get. Yeah. Hey, right. So you don't appreciate nothing that they did. Oh, uh, well, we got the elder coming out here in Columbus. You ain't gonna see me over here trying to teach yeah, him. Exactly. I'm like elder, like, you know. Right. <laughs> I had the fear on me. I'm like, I got watch what I say around this guy, because really? <laughs> he'll get in your ass. That's why he said, like, he, when he called, he said, I'm coming to check y'all. Yeah, he, yeah, that's what he said. I'm coming to check. I'm like, oh shit, we getting checked, Aku. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck, you better. Yeah, he pulled me to the side one time. He said, for somebody camp. I was like, oh shit. I was like, what's up? He said, you need, you need to, you say you uptight yeah, yeah. right now? Yeah, you be, like, oh, shit. that's how you be scared, but they need to just look it out for you. Yeah, I thought you were going to say Hey, stay over here. I'm going to get the cars on camera. Real, hey, but, hey, that's just, that's just, just goes to show you that the Lord is, 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 um, you know, a man of order. You know what I'm saying? Like. I remember the first time I met the elder, I was, I was like lightweight terrified. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I was scared because you all big. Yeah, he FaceTimed. Like, yeah, I was scared. Yeah, I was scared. I know if I meet the elder at the heart, I'll be like. Da, 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 da. Yeah. You know, you stuttering. Yeah, I remember even even I remember the first time I went to Chicago, the elder uh I can't remember his name right now. For real. Wow, what the fuck? 
My bad. So like Chicago? You remember my, you're Malcolm right. So like, oh, you're, right. okay, yeah. But he called me before we went up there. He called get, me. Come over this way, though. Your car is on camera. I'm going to get your car on camera. Okay. I was all nervous and shit. I was stuttering like, oh, right, 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 right. <laughs> stuttering like a motherfucker. You just nervous, you know what I'm saying? Hey, even with the, the Cleveland guys. I've been teaching longer than all them guys, I think, maybe. I don't know. Not, uh, that's not the point. The point is I was still scared the first time yeah. I met them. Yeah, when I went up to Cleveland. I was scared. Was out there, like, hey. Yeah, yeah. if y'all was acting why I was acting funny, because I was like way scared. I was making sure I was on my, I didn't say nothing stupid. I was on my good behavior. You know, even if I've been doing it longer than y'all, it's still, you know, that's the fear of the Lord. We should be in that spirit, man. Not being all loose. We ain't that's, loose. That's why the scriptures sell you, examine yourself. Fuck is hot. So you know when you got that feeling, you know what I'm saying? Hey, that's just your spirit. Like, hey, you examining yourself. You know, you making sure you're in order. You know? It's not really hard to do. Just man, just do what you're told, man. It's not like the elders. They don't even do nothing. Like, I mean, they they do a lot. They teach us, but they're not like micromanaging in our lives, calling you every five seconds. You better do this. You better do no. They don't. You know. But a brother come down, he'll check on us every once in a while and stuff, but they cool. They not out here yeah. being ass, they're not assholes. Yeah, that's, a, that's a fact, that's a fact. They not assholes, bro. Yeah. They not out here making your life fucking hard. Yeah, you know? You know, just me personally, with an elder dwelling with me, just being there, being with him day for day, yeah, that's a fact. He ain't, yeah, no, he ain't asshole. no asshole. Yeah, he ain't no asshole. Like, come here, brother, you know what I'm saying? He was, you know, chilling, rejoicing, he was coaching me. Saying, giving me pointers on how to move, etc. You know, you just take it in, man. You know, they not assholes. They ain't out here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, what's it called? What's that government? Uh, what's it called? Dictatorship. Oh, dictatorship. You know they should be though. It's like, <laughs> it is a dictatorship though. It, 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 but, but it's a, it's a. Yeah. What's the word? There's anarchy. a word. For, it's not like an anarchy, right? It's no. It's, it's a. It's a dictator. Anarchy's no leader. Dictatorship yeah. means oh, okay, okay. we sure. speak, you do. So it's a, uh, what's the word? Yeah, it's a benign dictatorship. What's the word yeah. for a good dictatorship? A benign is a, something like that. Just order. Order. No, I meant to say tyrant. Cause just because you're yeah, a, yeah, yeah, a tyrant, yeah, tyrant, that's the word. Because yeah, yeah. a dictator yeah, like, 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 don't mean tyrant. evil. Right, right, right. Dictator don't equate evil yeah. all the time. Yeah. yeah. Rock 32 and 8, that thy speech be short, comprehending much in few words. Yeah, so really, man, you should just yeah, man, be ready to listen instead of talk, man. He has one that knoweth and yet holdeth his tongue. And that's why, too, when you, when you, this goes for everybody when you're on the internet, don't be quick to just type anything on the comment board, man. I hate well, I hate reading some uh, of the yeah, comments. Yeah, yeah. Dude, some of these, some bro, of be they be sounding, yeah, cringe. That's the perfect word. They be cringe, right. bro. Y'all be cringe on them comic boards. <laughs> right. That's hold my peace. Yeah, yeah that's what I do. Even when the elder, because the apostle could bark like, hey, you know, comment if this is edifying. It's like, I don't know what's edifying. Yeah. I ain't about to say nothing. Like, yeah, I'd be scared, bro. That's why I don't, unless I have something edifying to say, keep your mouth shut, man. Right. It says, uh, if thou be among great men, make not thyself equal with them. <laughs> when ancient men are in place, use not many words. The you gonna have, you always gonna have guys that are gonna get around the elders, and they and they trying to uh, like the elders are suckers. Like they gonna be like, uh, what's that? A warm, you know, a warm tongue is. They gonna try to get in the elders ear. Like I'm gonna be the elder sidekick. I'm gonna be his number one man. Right, no, bro, sit see, your ass down. Yeah, sit your ass down, bro. Cause you got guys, some guys that think they can talk their way to the top and all kind of shit. Man, the, the most high set this thing up, man. Because, see, the thing is, this ain't about that. I'm trying to be all high position. You know what I'm saying? Who gives a That's yeah. that IUIC spirit. I don't want no high position. Yeah, that's why I tell myself. I just want to be meek and lonely and just, you know what I'm saying, be pleasing to the Father. I don't want nobody even calling me, bro. I don't want to be <laughs> dealing with, you know? Who the hell would want to deal with uh, uh, wicked-ass Israelites, you know? Cause there'd be a lot of people like the elders are hard say, it. I, you know, there's a lot of people in GMS that ain't fucking right, you know. Probably I ain't one of them. It says, Before the thunder goeth lightning, and before a shame faced man shall go favor. Shame faced man go favor, yeah. So just be humble, man. 
That's the point of this video. Be humble. Don't disrespect your elders. Stay in your lane. Know your place. You know, it's just all about respect, man. You know, about moving smoothly and uh, doing things the right way. About order, you know? Like, y'all ever watch no gangster movies or nothing? Like, you don't know how to act? Like, what are y'all doing, man? Because we really go harder than the mafia, actually. Because we don't, we don't commit crimes, though, you know? It's the La Costa Nostra. It's like... This thing of ours, that's what it means. Go ahead. He says, my brother, and be not many masters, knowing that we all shall receive the greater condemnation. Yeah, there's not many masters, what, you know? You got one. You, you, got, you got the head of, of you got Elder Tahar's the head. Then you got the head and the bishops and the head after. It's order, bro. You, get it, you know? That dude stepped out of place. You step out of place, and that's it, bro. You up out of here. I'm about done. You ready? Because the battery's about to die anyway. We're going to give all praises unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rakaku Dash. Say Braka to Yahweh. Braka to Yahweh Shai. Braka to Rakaku Dash. We say Shalom. Save the king. God damn it. God save the king. God save the king. <laughs> Dude, I